questions are not counted in time, so you can introduce yourself first. Piggy Pie by Margie Palatini. Chris the Witch woke up grouchy, grumpy, and very hungry. Her belly grumbled for something delicious, something delightful, something special. But what? It wasn't Purple Mouse Tail Stew. No. no. She ate that yesterday for lunch. How about some mashed dragon tongue pudding? No, it wasn't in the mood for anything quite that sweet. Perhaps the taste of boiled, black, buzzard feet? That always made our mouth water. No, not today. Today, Grish wanted something truly tasty, something really yummy, something special. And that could only mean piggy pie. Yes, yes, piggy pie. I can taste those plump, juicy pink pigs right now. She hurried to the pantry and pulled down her old hat cookbook from the top shelf. She picked off the spider and blew off the dust and turned to the secret recipe on page 342. Gritch ran her bony finger with a long green nail down the list of ingredients. One eye of a fly? No problem. Two shakes of a rattlesnake's rattle? No problem. Three belly hairs of a possum? No problem. Eight plump piggies? Eight plump piggies? Problem! I don't have any piggies. How can I make piggy pie than one puny pink pig? Gritch pulled her hair. She stomped her feet. She paced the floor. She wanted piggy pie. She wanted piggy pie very much. Now, where could I find eight plump piggies? Grish thought and thought and thought. Ah, the circus. Yes, yes, the circus. The circus? No, no, no not the circus. Ah, the zoo. Yes, yes, the zoo. The zoo? No, 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 not the zoo. The, the, the farm? Yes, yes, the farm. There was just one teeny tiny little problem. Where to find the farm? Where else? The yellow pages. I'll just let my bony fingers do the walking. Old MacDonald's farm called E-I-E-I-O. We have ducks, chickens, cows, and piggies. Grish put her broomstick in here and headed over the river and through the woods to Old MacDonald's farm. I've got you in my sights now, you little porkers. Surrender, piggies. The piggies ran off, but they didn't surrender. No, indeed, they had a plan of their own. Grish zoomed in for a thump, thump, urgh, landing. She switched straw, fanned her still-smoking tootsies, and lifted her goggles. There wasn't a pig in sight. Where did they all go? Hey, duck, I said, where are all the piggies? I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. The, the duck, duck went, quack, quack. Here a duck, duck, quack, quack. There, there a duck, duck, quack, quack. Everywhere a duck, 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 quack, quack. No piggies. What do you mean, no piggies, you dizzy duck? I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. Hand over the hogs, you little quacker. No piggies. Grinch pulled her hair. She stomped her feet. She even threatened the duck with one of her most evil spells. The duck was not impressed. It wasn't even scared. Quack. So who needs a dumb duck? Be careful where she stepped. Grish wandered across the meadow and called to a cow. Yoo-hoo! Moo? You! Where are the piggies? I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. The cow went. Moo, moo. Here a moo. Moo, moo. There a moo. Moo, moo. Everywhere a moo, moo. Moo, moo. No piggies. What do you mean, no piggy, you lumpy looking cow? I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. Now fork over the pork, you walking milk machine, or I'll curdle your cream. No piggies. Grinch pulled her hair. She stomped her feet. She even threatened the cow with one of her most evil spells. The cow didn't care. Moo. Cows, who needs them? So Grinch tried the barnyard where she stopped a chicken in his tracks. Okay, bird brain, where are the piggies? I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. The chicken went, cluck, cluck. 
Here a clock, clock, clock. There a clock, clock, clock. Everywhere a clock, 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 clock. No piggies. What do you mean, no piggies, you dizzy duck? What's going on here? Who's the boss of this heap of hay? The, the chicken, chicken flapped a wing to old McDonald. Your old McDonald? Don't look much like your picture, do you? Now look, Shorty, I've been quack quacked here, moo moo there, and cluck clucked everywhere, all over this farm. I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. Where are those piggies? The farmer looked here, he looked there, here he looked, there he looked, everywhere he looked, looked. No piggies. What do you mean, no piggies, you flea bitten seed spreader? You must have piggies. Your stomach growls, it grumbles, but if there were no piggies, there would be no piggy pie. Now what am I going to eat? Excuse me, little lady. Wolf's the big. Let me give you some advice. Forget about those pigs. Forget about the pigs? They're too tricky. Trust me, I've been chasing three little pigs for days. He huffed and huffed. Look at me, I'm sorry, I'm nothing but skin and bones. Well, you're not quite. Mr. Wolf, I have the most wonderful idea. I was thinking since you haven't eaten and I have eaten, why don't you come home with me for lunch? I'm a very good cook. Why, that does sound tempting. Are you sure it would be any problem? Problem? Why, it's no problem at all. I always enjoy having a wolf for lunch. The, the end? end? <laughs> <laughs>